protects the workers of the center and the economies of the center, but actually harms uh, the workers of uh, the periphery. So to give you an example, um, let's say why would one want to hire a Romanian worker when one does renovation of a house in Berlin or Brussels or London? Uh, usually because this, this worker is cheaper uh, than the local worker. Uh, if the Romanian worker loses this comparative advantage, uh, he will be not interested, interesting to the market anymore. So uh, my fear is that this principle could actually end up harming uh, the workers of the European Union. Oh, by all means, they change the bargaining power of the peripheral companies, of the peripheral workers, vis-a-vis -vis the companies of the center. Um, so it is, I believe, actually much damaging to the periphery. Um, so the economic disparities for this reason are bound to increase rather than decrease, which is actually the overall goal of the Union, right? We want the European Union to be equally developed uh, throughout the European Union. We want equal distribution of wealth. And um, this solution is not working to that, for that purpose, but is actually counterproductive.